Welcome back. Bounce back culture has long pressured mothers to slim down to their pre-baby body, whatever that is, as soon as possible. But fitness queen Tiff Hall is rejecting the toxic trend after delivering her second child, encouraging mums to focus on progress, not perfection. Tiff joins us now from Melbourne. Tiff, great to see you again. You welcomed your beautiful girl, Vader, a few months ago. So how's that going for you? I mean, you're someone who's been in the fitness industry. I mean, there's obviously... You, your instinct is, is to go hard. How are you coping with it? I'm, cho I'm choosing to bounce forward, not bounce back. And that just means going slowly, celebrating the small wins, and most importantly, not comparing myself to others. Vader is so cute. She's just so cute. And I'm just loving being in that baby bubble still. Tell us, oh, so gorgeous. Okay. And, and that's the thing too, it is a bubble and it feels like it's never going to end when you're in it, but all of a sudden it's over and it's past. And so it is really important to soak up that time in your life, isn't it? Tell us about this whole bounce back culture and the theory and why it is so damaging. I think it's so damaging looking back and saying I want to get back to my pre-baby body instead of looking forward and thinking, well, I could get even stronger. I think compar comparing yourself to others, it can be so emotionally and mentally damaging. Instead of focusing on that fourth trimester, the first couple of months with your baby and not buying into diets and returning to exercise in an unsafe way. It's really about being sustainable and getting your body back in time, but really looking after your mental health in the process. So tell us about bounce forward then. This is a term you've come up with. What does it mean? Yes, bounce forward just means not comparing yourself to others, celebrating the small wins. And on Monday, I'm launching my 12-week bounce forward challenge. So you can come with me. I'll train you with meal plans, workouts, mindfulness, and show you what it's all about. And it's 12 weeks, and I will show you just how strong you can get without going so hard and smashing yourself. Well, that can be really dangerous too. Your body has shifted and changed so drastically through pregnancy and birth and, and postnatal experiences as well. So what are some simple and safe exercises for new mums to take on? Well, number one, I think it's really important to be mindful of the way you get out of bed and get up off the floor. You're on the floor a lot with the little ones. So always roll your knees to the side. Don't crunch because that can really damage your core early on. Then I'd start with just simple pelvic tilts. The pelvic tilts activate the core and you can do them standing up or lying down. And then the famous glute bridge. You can't beat it. It works the glutes and it works the core without putting pressure on the pelvic floor. What should mums do then, Tiff, to avoid this injury? Well, just stay away from lifting heavy weights, wow. high impact exercise, mm. and definitely stay away from crunches because if you've had some ab separation, that can be quite damaging. And you know, we all s scroll through Instagram and TikTok and things in the middle of the night when we're breastfeeding and up late with a baby. Uh, what is your final advice for mothers post birth who are struggling to navigate that bounce back culture and are comparing themselves to the images they're seeing day in, day out? I think you need to do an edit of your social media and just unfollow anyone that's giving you that toxic energy. I, I've done it myself and focus on the people that inspire you who are being real and seek out experts, you know, your women's health physios, good trainers, um, people online who are going to educate you in the right way. Yeah. Tiff, it's really great advice and uh, we thank you so much for being here today and go back to your daughter and have a great time. Love your work, Tiff. <laughs> Thank you. Tips, See fitness, soon. tips and guides and activewear, head to mytxo.com. She's a real deal, isn't she? We love her.